in with certain members of our class? You see, Max? Oh. I told you we'd be here before Professor. You better sit down before he comes. Okay, okay. Good evening. <laughs> How did you get in? Through the window? You're late. Too busy drinking in the pub to notice the time? Well, we've not been in a pub, have we, Max? Sure we haven't. <laughs> Look, we were coming to the school and we see this old lady trying to cross the road. Yeah, that's right, she was very old. A hand very blind. Yeah, pushing a pram. <laughs> An old blind lady pushing a pram. Uh, well, maybe she wasn't exactly blind. Well, maybe she wasn't exactly there either. Sure is true. On Max's life, we have not been in that pub. Honest. All right. Hey, you left your books in the pub. <laughs> What's the matter? Look behind you. <laughs> Not been in the pub, eh? Now I remember we were there just for a minute. Come on, sit down, all of you. Hey, why you not tell me the teachers behind me, you Italian macaroni? Why you lying? <laughs> you lump of Spanish omelette? <laughs> all right, come on, sit down and be quiet. Hey, teacher is right. You sit down. Sit down, be quiet. Go on, sit down. Go on, sit down. Sit down. Yeah, why, that includes you. Por favor. You heard. <laughs> Sit down. I'm getting rather tired of this continual habit of certain people being late. At 7.30 is the time class commences and you should all be sitting at your desks ready to begin work. Now, I shan't tell you again. In future, anybody who comes late will go straight home. Good evening, everybody. <laughs> You're late. Hey. Oh, no. Look, please. I'm being early. It is only 20 minutes past the 7 o'clock. Correction, it is 25 minutes to the 8. That clock is not being right at all. Oh. And I suppose my watch is not being right also. Yes, please. <laughs> Has it occurred to you that it might be your watch that is wrong? Oh, blimey. This watch is guaranteed never to be wrong. It is 21 Julies. <laughs> Jewels. Yes, please. Hmm. I'm buying it today from the marketplace. You bought that watch from a stall on the market? Most definitely. The man is telling me it is jolly good bargain. 21 Julies and real gold case. 18 turnips. 18 carrots. Sorry, please. Well, how much did you pay for this 21 jeweled 18 carat gold timepiece? Uh, a two pound 50 pence. I think he saw you coming, Ali. Oh, most definitely. He was seeing me coming before I was seeing him. Mm -hmm. but what I mean is you were swindled. Oh, no. You can't buy a watch for two pounds fifty. Ah, but the man is telling me it is being so cheap because it is bankruptured stuck. Rupt head. <laughs> it's not going, Ali. Uh, perhaps it needs a wind up? Well, there's nothing to wind up. <laughs> Look, it's empty. Oh, blimey. I am being cheated. Excuse me, please. I go to find the crooked well, man. You won't be there now, Ali. Uh, what about my money? Well, you just have to put it down to experience. Now, sit down. We've got a lot of work to do. Thank <laughs> you.